Hey guys, I've just got off the back of recording my overview of DSM-7 and the Sonality Taiwanese launch event. And now I want to talk more about some of the individual things I saw there. And today I want to talk about Sonology's photo application. <laughs> This is the amalgamation of Synology Moments and Synology Photo Station being merged into a single platform, a single application that gives the advantages of one and the other and then bungs it into both. Why is this such a big deal? Well, for those that follow this channel or NAS Compares or Span or Span TV or any of the other different platforms, you will know that one of my biggest bugbears with Synology is their kind of our way or the hard way. They aren't a hugely flexible company uh, when it comes to the way they do things because they look at um, a whole prospectus of what people want. They look at, um, they you know, they do lots of surveys and stuff like that. And ultimately, what they create is what people want in the software stakes. But there will always be people that want to do things their way. And Synology Photo Station, although a great application that allows you to browse uh, file, files and folders quite, quite well, had lots of features that were kind of not there in Moments. Moments had that facial recognition and a tagging system. It had thing note, um, identification and it had the ability to search through files and folders very, very easily and quickly. Something that Photo Station didn't. But um, Moment forced you, for the most part, to choose a certain folder for your media, which was, if not different, then complexly um, unhelpful compared to that of Photo Station. So what they've done is they've looked at all the things that are good about Photo Station and all the things that are good about Moments, and they understand that people have got confused, and that's why they've merged them into this one application, which has the benefits of both merged together and even a few extra things twinkled on. So, for example, um, the ability to browse folders and um, organise those folders in a greater fashion, such as present in Photo Station, will now be in this Synology Photos app. On top of that, of course, facial recognition, tagging, thing recognition, locational tracking, that kind of stuff is all included. But this new Synology Photos app will also have a better filtering system because those that have ever used Photo Station will know that as good as the filters are, they aren't really great when you're looking for stuff that doesn't define those filters in advance. It doesn't say the name of the album or doesn't say that the photo contains this, that or the other. And that's why Moments was created to use that AI assisted search parameter to allow you to look for photos of things or people without their names being in the title or being in the name of the album or a playlist. But on top of these filters, you can also narrow it down and, and include all filters from location to facial tracking, uh, tagging, uh, track in, tagging, and the ability to have those albums within a certain timeline. All of these filters have all been added together now into this one filter filter system. So you won't have to rely on searching through photos um, using one or the other. And I know I'm not talking to a large contingent of you, and that's my point about this, that the people that have been affected by these problems are not the commonest of people. They are the, the two out of 10, the four out of 20 people that have had to search for a certain kind of photo that can use some of the search parameters of photo station or some of the photo um, search parameters of moments, but it's just not merged in an intuitive way. And that's the other reason for Sonology photos. Don't get me wrong, I can already see someone in the comments, and I'll be honest, it kind of occurred to me as well going, Sonology photos, Google photos. Hmm, similar. Well, you're right, the names are similar because it's just an obvious name, let's face it. Most of these brands use the word station on the end of their name probably because of PlayStation, who knows? But look at when they were released, it's kind of a theory of mine. But the other good thing about this is they've improved the sharing aspect. Um, with Photo Station, sharing photos seemed a lot easier than it did on Moments, and they've taken a lot of that and merged it into this Synology Photos application. It gives you the ability to share with other users within your network and externally, but also keep track of what's shared with whom and photos that are shared between different people, creating a far more collaborative photo space. Um, and thanks to that ability to search for folders in a better way, you end up with a far, far greater tool at your disposal than the sum of it, uh, than the two other individual bits. So again, this has been Synology Photos. We will talk about this a lot more. Hopefully, when we've got our hands on DSM7 Beta. If you 
fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Um, and otherwise we'll of course touch on this more in Germany. Hopefully they'll have a system laid out for us so we can check this out first hand. I'll see you on the next video. Do check out the videos for Active Insight Hybrid Share, that great new SSD um, caching techniques they're going to be employing and of course more on DSM7 and that hardware. Click like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next video.